<sighs> Dear diary. So, uh, it's now about to be 1 p.m. in the afternoon or something. And um, right now it's fairly sunny, but not uh, that good. Um, I, thankfully, I wasn't late on my first lecture, but the other two were, I was quite late of them, just because I was buying some food, and the food obviously took a pretty long time. And, um, I'm gonna be honest, uh, a tiny bit, I was tiny, I was at first again having thoughts and other flashbacks about you know and um and then um i reached there and got that lecture and um, while being outside i don't know if i was being improved any better or like getting any better however um things are fairly fairly decent i think and um i guess uh, i was supposed to focus but then you know how it is nowadays but then thankfully Thankfully, this time, while I was out and late on the lectures, I I kind of had uh, quite a relaxation time, and it was quite nice. And um, you know, I honestly wanted I want to experience a fucking summer weather again with all of the sun all over you while you're out with your uh, summer clothes aka the half sleeve shirts and stuff and um, later on summer house time that would probably make me forget everything who knows and um, and of course during my time outside I was a little bit into thinking and um, been reminded about how literally mistaken I am just for Literally making first moves, like, why do you even love? Why are you in love? Why do you want to even make a move? Why are you even having any kind of thoughts? You just don't. Like, you just don't love. You just don't make any first moves. You just don't even bother yourself with it. You're gonna literally put yourself into, like, unnecessary troubles and dramas and what who knows what could happen you could literally get into jail just for being in love and showing and expressing love you know what i'm saying i know that nowadays we're doing this but i i honestly don't believe it and i won't even believe that it's being done in any shape or any kind of thing because yo love is fake and uh let's be real being in a relationship was never meant to be it was never meant to be you know only the quote unquote cool guys can be in a relationship and can actually have women compassion and warmth and all that you know you could you could even, like, I don't know, burn your face and make it ten times shinier and brighter. And you could get them in seconds. 
have some stupid muscles all over your chest and arms and you are easily their favorite or become Asian with some edgy looking freaking hair and uh, some blue eyes and really black eyebrows and whatsoever and a ridiculously white face with some lush marks and per I don't know what they were called but or freckles and you would actually get them in seconds but the best way to to get some girls become an anime guy I'm not joking become an anime guy or at least become any closer to them like make a cosplay about any of their favorite anime or K-pop artists and you will legit get them in seconds because let's be real no one will ever love the other for themselves unless they become exactly what they want and then the personality would be discussed later but you just need to get onto that look but then for people like me and anyone else that is introvert or having or having troubles and stuff you just don't like you just don't you just don't fall in love you just don't bother you just don't even think about it it's over already you just don't fall in love you just don't make a move you just don't even bother on even with the thought of it the slightest thought of it you're just gonna watch and just walk away move on with your life Really, being alone is what suits you better. And that's what I have honestly should have just got in like probably not less than uh, eight years ago. And um, yeah. If being in love is a fantasy and being in a relationship is a fantasy for anyone like me out there and is obviously not gonna ever feel the warmth of a woman or a decent human being then um, okay fine you're just gonna warm yourself up by yourself because this is our society and I refuse to believe that society would go beyond of what I have already been accustomed to back in the day but boy society sure is devolving and devolving even more right now as we speak like who knows maybe they will be making a rule of not even talking to girls in the first place and make like a boys only internet and a girls only internet then we will be back to the time where boys and girls men and women are gonna be separated from each other in almost everything you know and whoever just gets any girly stuff or any type of uh, anything related to women you're basically gonna be considered as a woman and gonna be ridiculous of. that's legit how it was back in the day especially in Egypt especially like in 2000 until like 2008 2010 like I'm being serious I'm being serious this is what society used to be especially at like the early generation with most kids uh, like and you just gotta be all muscular as a guy you just gotta put all those tests of strong and, and just nothing else you know anything aside from that you'll be fucked over and maybe even murdered brutally
And once again, whoever disagrees and is going to say that it's bullshit, I understand. Like, I understand that what I'm saying is bullshit. But this is what society is like. Like, look around, y'all. Look around, y'all. This is our society in fucking real life and online. And whether it's tr- and whether anyone thinks that it's true or not is not my problem because this is our reality. This is our fucking reality. <sighs> and honestly, I still kind of refuse to accept that. But it's about time to just wake up from my illusional, delusional uh, dream world and just accept that this is my reality. And who knows, whether it gets better or not, it's not even my concern anymore. And whatever happens, let it happen. Honestly, I gave up. I gave up on this world way long ago. And not only that, but Aaron, Aaron in Attack of Titan, at season four, he was right. He is so fucking right at every word he said and at everything he does. He did to the motherfucking whole island and that other goddamn island. He was so right about everything. He legit, like, exactly shaped everything that humanity has ever done. Because let's be real. Those who remember the past, and those who are going to fuck people over for it, and completely destroy your whole past views and other good things about this world are the reason why this world is so close to judgment day <sighs> right that's enough for me right now and um hopefully you all understand see ya